Did that bang up your Jeep, Eddie? Hey, no! Uh. Perfect, hold it, hold it, hold it! How did that happen? We had an accident. All right, guys, here's the deal, right? We're in the middle of Southern Utah right now for one good reason. My buddy Robbie built a fully built XJ on 39s with walkers and everything. And we're out here. We're going to go to Sand Hollow National Park and go rock crawling. In less than five minutes, I have to go drive up one of the gnarliest trails around here in a Jeep that I've never seen before. That sounds dumb, doesn't it? <laughs> black diamond maybe so i don't know any of that but you're gonna be nervous a couple places the gatekeeper is the scariest part but it's pretty steep and it's easy for the front end to slide sideways and roll off from it so i've also but never spotted anybody and that's my job today so are you like gonna be outside with yeah. a headset you're, yep. hey weston yep. you're rolling over hey weston <laughs> brace yourself you're about to go over <laughs> I didn't know Matt partied like that. I do not want this to be known as the Jeep that Weston Champlin rolled, but if you do it, I'm not gonna be mad. That's fine. It's just like a sea of YouTubers out here. Because everywhere I look, I see YouTubers. Well, I've named you as my nemesis, so. Oh, okay. You're going okay. down. What was your name? <laughs> <laughs> we ready? Yeah. Let's party like 1994. All right, Weston's gonna do great, and he's not gonna roll it. Did that bang up your Jeep, Eddie? No. Oh. Okay, you're climbing, so keep coming. Okay, go drive her a little. Drive her. Oh, I got four. All the way down, you're gonna drop off. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I think is funny about this? What I think is hilarious is the fact that Robbie has this Jeep, this really, really nice, and we get to drive behind him as he walks this trail, and he can hear me because he's on the radio right now, so he can hear me saying this. Oh, yeah, yeah. What, wait, what is that? What is what? What is that? That is what you're going to crawl up next. Is that the chute? Nope. The chute is straight up. That looks pretty straight up, Robbie. It's pretty sweet. Look at it. Yeah, yeah. No, I think I'm good. I'll get out right here. Do you want to take it easy or take it hard? Uh, let's take it easy. Okay, so go drive. Okay, straight. Straight now. Okay, you're going to go drive her a tiny bit. Driver, I'm going to have you follow this crack. Slow, slow, slow. Okay. Oh, we're rubbing. No, you're good. Okay, go passenger, passenger, straight. You're good, you're good. Look at that, you don't even have to back up. When you get up here, we're gonna go driver and drop down. You're gonna keep your driver's tire right here on this ledge, so go passenger. Okay, hold it. Oh, passenger. Oh, that's dippy. That's nice. We just gotta keep you out of that humongous crack underneath you. You know, okay. I don't wanna say this too soon, but you're doing a good job spot. Thank you, go passenger gonna fall off this rock about three feet it's about to fall off it's gonna feel weird you're good I don't really want to drop off and no you're not gonna you're not gonna fall you're out of the crack okay you're gonna fall you're not gonna roll drivers okay here you're falling okay easy drivers you're good you're good you know Robbie I will be honest I trust you a lot right now you so this is the hard this is the weird one you got a deep deep like 10 foot crevice so hold up okay you're gonna start coming back down now you're gonna go driver right now. Perfect, that was one people roll on. Oh, you tell me that afterwards, thank <laughs> yeah. you very much. Well, if you look back, there's like a 15 foot drop off. Oh my, Robbie, there's no way you drove me through that. Yeah. I don't know. Back up. Back up. Burn them. Hey, stop. No, perfect. Hold it, hold it, hold it. Hey, no. I would like to thank today's sponsor of the video, Factor. Now, the thing is, you might be wondering what Factor is. Well, Factor 
It's a pretty dang good food. Hold on, throw that in the microwave. Boom, two minutes we're gonna have some good food. But let me tell you exactly what Factor is. Factor makes meeting your nutrition goals easier than ever by delivering fresh, never frozen, dietitian approved meals right to your doorstep. A team of gourmet chefs create each individual meal using only ingredients with integrity to help you feel your best all day long. Eat stress-free this spring with Factor's delicious ready to eat meals. Every fresh, never frozen meal is chef crafted, dietitian approved, and ready to eat in just two minutes. You can choose from a weekly menu of 35 options including keto, calorie smart, protein plus, or veggie. You can discover more add-ons like breakfast, on the go lunch, snacks, beverages, whatever you need to stay fueled and feel good all day long, you can get it at Factor. Head to factor75.com or click the link below and use code WESTON50 to get 50% off your first Factor box and 20% off your next Factor box. So that's code WESTON50 at factor75.com to get 50% off your first box plus 20% off your next box while your subscription is active. Damn, that's juicy, look at that. Oh, that's good. Well, now this just went from a, a um, sponsorship to lunch, so. <laughs> Thank you, Factor, for sponsoring today's video. I'm gonna go finish my lunch. Hey, no. Hey, you know the advantage of this is this ain't my Jeep, so I don't care. How's that going, Robbie? How's that feel? Well, you know what? We were just we were just in an automobile accident. So how's it going? How do, how do you think I'm doing? I think you're doing great. Yeah, well, Whoever built this machine knew exactly what they were doing. They didn't build the back window very good. How did that happen? Hey, no. We had an accident. So right up here, we got a wall. Like legit, a two and a half foot sheer wall. Okay, you're on the rock, it's gonna climb. Still. Right there, go driver. Hold it, hold it. Right there. What? Can I do a burnout in this thing up here? So let's get your wheel set and we'll pull out the back end and then do a front burnout. Okay, hold it. So put it in neutral. Take your right. your right stick, put it in the center. All the way in first. And then hold the brake and push it. Okay, warming them tires up. Yo, you're smoking, keep going. Okay, good, let's back up. Hey, sometimes you get stuck in the rocks. It's just such a disadvantage that we had to do a good burnout like I that. know, twice. I know, that is so sad. All right, Weston, Griffin, Michael. Good how week. you doing? Yeah, how you doing? You are now the winner of the first Off-Road Games Burnout Contest. How do you feel? Oh man, I honestly, I was just doing it for fun, but you know, if you if somebody's gotta be the best, I guess it ought to be me. Hey, well it is you, it's, this is all for fun, that's all this is about. What's your experience so far? You know, I thought this was gonna be really, really scary, but what I realized is if I don't own the Jeep, not that bad. Oh, absolutely, yeah. <laughs> oh, this looks gnarly. This looks real gnarly. So, what we wanna do, we need your driver tire. Do we wanna put the driver's front? tire right up here? So we're gonna put the driver's tire here. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yep, so all the way driver now. Keep a driver, you're gonna fall on your slider. Ah! Good. I finally banged on something! What'd you say? Yeah! These people want me to send it. I, I didn't do it. Oh, I'm gonna fall. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm gonna lay down Baywatch style. Go ahead and do it. Oh, you're good, just dig it. Life the garden, dig it! You're good. <laughs> so guys, we're still getting cocky with this now, so now we're just trying stuff that's hard. Okay, you're gonna start to climb just easy, easy, easy. Just real slow, it's gonna climb it. As Soon as it climbs it, you're gonna go passenger, okay? Passenger, you're gonna hit your slider. Yeah! That back tire, it just floats up. <laughs> okay, just when you thought it was over, now we got more. We have more? <laughs> Lots more. I thought we were done. Nope, wait till you see it. Oh, sweet Jesus. Robbie, <laughs> what are you doing to me? The trick is, is once we get up, you do have to go. So I'm gonna get to the top of it. Okay, go. Driver, 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 driver straight. Go, 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 go. Passenger, passenger. Go, go, driver, driver. Oh, it didn't even, oh. it wasn't even hard. When are we gonna find something hard, Robbie? I, you've dominated every single thing that was supposed Dude, to be hard. Dude, this is, this goes down. Dude, this I thought hard. it was gonna struggle, honestly. Um, so I think we crest this and then there's the chute. How hard's the chute? It's like this. It's vertical? Oh yeah. Like straight like up? 97 degrees. That's more than 90 Hold degrees, on, 87 Robbie. degrees. <laughs> 97 degrees is I'm backwards. It's just enough that if you keep the correct line, you won't flip. How likely is it to flip? I mean, lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of people flip. Okay. There's one final thing for the day that's called the shoot, which is basically a straight up wall that's right over there that they want us to try to drive up. 
that you're going to drive up. Oh, that I'm going to drive up. <laughs> no peer pressure. No peer pressure at all. No pressure at all. Don't roll no. up. Matt's off for recovery and all these guys that put on this event did an epic job. We had some epic trails. And I got to thank them for letting us come out here and have a good time. And Robbie for inviting us. Yeah, thank you for coming. Yeah. We're at the bottom of the shoe. I'm not sure this Jeep will make it up, but I'm getting ready to tell you if we can or not. If we come down upside down, you know we didn't make it. Questions up. Let's see if he can do it. Really does not do it justice. It looks like they're climbing it so easily, no big deal. But this is almost like driving your car straight up a wall. Fourth place loser for the off-road games is Weston Champlin and Robbie Layton. Will you guys get up here? Fourth place loser! Give it up for Redneck Science! So Weston here had a burnout competition with himself, and he claims that he won first. Here's the thing, right? No one else is competing. That's their fault. First of all. We told them about it. We told them about it. They seen us doing burnouts, and we just did a better job. First! First place? First place <laughs> Here's the thing, guys. We didn't win, but we had fun. And that's where we did better than all these other guys. I'm gonna take my trophy home and proudly put it on the shelf.